This is John Mendez with Expert Village. We're the next one we'll do one and a half inch cut. And to get these to connect, we're gonna put little connectors on them. And these connectors are the same thing. They are 0 0.06 millimeter. So they're kind of tight, but they do fit on the ends of this beading chain really, really nicely. Even though they are the same diameter, the hole, as well as the chain, it does fit. And you don't need to solder them. They just slip right on, and then we're going to pinch it closed with our cutters and make sure that we don't pinch too hard because we'll cut them right off, and then you have to start over, and then you have supplies that are wasted. So we're going to go ahead and um, put one of these right in that hole. And you could feel it slip in really, really easily. But you don't want to go too far because it'll go all the way through to the loop. So you want to pull it back just a little bit. And take your cutters and just pinch it right close to the edge of your connector and test it and it'll be on there nice and tight and it's nice and durable. You can also, if you choose, add a little dab of super glue if you're not confident that you've pinched it enough. Um, I choose not to do that. I'd much rather go over it and repinch it again just to make sure that it's closed. Or you can even start another pinch closer to the edge so you get two perforations and uh, test it out and see how that goes and it'll, it'll stay. This is the one inch and um, before we close the other end we're going to add a couple of crystals on here so that you get a little um, color and a little glamour on there so that it's not so plain. 